I was going, I wanted to add one more thing. Okay, I wrote down the, kind of the sample scenario so I could explain it to you guys. Um, if you could read my handwriting, this is what my list usually kind of looks like. I have transaction number one, and I have the supplements, which were those. And they're on sale for $10, so you pay $10, and then you get $10 register rewards. Okay, so I know I have all the register rewards written on the sides, so I know what I'm getting. Okay, transaction number two. Degree deodorant on sale, four for 15, which is 375 each. Use two, buy one, get one free coupons. Use two, one dollar off of one coupons. That's a total of four coupons for four items. Um, so you get four for 750 and you get the five dollars red stored back and then the cracker folds two dollars use the 75 cents off of one coupon brings it to a dollar twenty five and you get two dollars register rewards scott paper towels three ninety nine use dollar fifty off of one coupon i use a lot of abbreviations <laughs> um, you get it for two fifty the popcorn was twenty five cents that was my filler item all the totals of transaction number two came to eleven fifty and then I used the $10 register rewards from transaction number one, brought it to $1.50, and I came away with $7 register rewards. So in the end, I paid $11.50 for both transactions, and I'm coming away with the $7 register rewards. Hope that makes sense.